Give me a low... Yes! Oh, yes. Okay. These monkeys are going to be all over us. We're going to have to compete with them to pick this stuff up. At least it's just one right now. They're going to swarm us picking these berries. Too slow, idiot monkey, you moron. Geeks, what is going on? Unite the Clans here, back in your life with another episode of Don't Starve Shipwrecked as Walani. We have just built ourselves a science machine, if you missed the last one. If you missed the last one, you're a fool. Go watch the whole series. Click on the little I, letter I in the top right corner. Somewhere in there will be the playlist for this thing. Shovel is our first order of business, and we get started with a farm. I know there were a couple berry bushes around here. At least two, uh, at least three. We're going to go get those, and we're going to start ourselves a farm out here in this pasture. If we see anything else awesome along the way, we will harvest it. But berries are concern number one. And we'll have to fertilize these, which means getting some, some things that decompose or monkey poop. Like, if I leave some berries or some petals on the ground, eventually they will turn into fertilizer called rot. But the most efficient one is poop, which we can actually get from our pig friend as well, uh, Theodosius. The high, hi, high Holy Roman Emperor. Different job, different title. I guess I could break up that skeleton for bone shards. I'm not sure what bone shards do yet. Uh, and we'll be chopping down and burning down part of this forest for some basic resources. But... More gold is on the to-do list, I think. So we'll get this farm started. Maybe we'll pick enough flowers. Uh, I'll pick maybe six, eight flowers. And we'll just leave them to rot on the ground. And hopefully turn those into some fertilizer. Darkness is here. And another berry. Another berry bush. I'll take that. Oh, darkness is here, guys. We're starting late on day three. I guess I'm paying less attention to days and more attention to time right now. Uh, how many flowers I got? One more should do the trick, and we will, uh... Ooh, we'll get a fire started as night falls upon us. Fuel is added. Berry bushes come to me. Uh, plant, do not add fuel. <laughs> there's one. There's two. There's three. There's four. We are getting set up. We're getting set up pretty good. And, uh, let's get these petals rotten on the ground. Drop those. Uh, we'll pick some new petals for a headband once our sanity starts getting hurt, but right now, I think the goal is just feeding ourselves, and we'll do that with some seaweed. And we'll hold on to these berries. We'll cook them a little later, because if you wait to cook them, then when they cook them, they're fresher, I think. All right, we are back to normal. So, immediate priorities, things to build. What is on that list of things? We could start trapping. I do want to find some fish. Hmm. Spear would be good. Let's grab our rope here. Let's, yes, let's get the defenses up and a better backpack. These are our immediate goals. Spear. Crafted. There's the spear. Equipped. Who's intimidating now, fool? There we go. <laughs> and how do I make some log armor? Log suit? Whatever you call it. Limestone seashell log. Two more rope. Oh, man, that fire's going out. Come on. Come on, Walani. Add some fire fuel to that fire lord. That was close. Oh. Eat some more. There we go. Well, man, this is how you die in this mother. Okay, log suit, hay wall. What do I need? I need two rope. There we go. We got plenty and plenty of grass, and there's more where that came from. You know it. Uh, log suit. Alright, and log suit and spear will keep close to each other in the hot bar so that if it danger befells us, we switch back and forth. Now, next goal, improved backpack. This one's only got four slots. There's one here that has uh, eight, and that's the one we want. Okay, we need more sticks. We'll, we'll go, we'll head out in the morning in search of sticks. Where's the nearest sticks? Uh, oh, in the swamp. That's where it is. Let's get the axe out. Do I have an axe? I do have an axe. And we'll leave all these potatoes until we need them, until things get rough. Uh, we'll grab that flint, though. And yes, these these trees here, these ones that I mentioned, the mangrove trees, you get logs, but you also get sticks. So when you're in a biome that doesn't have a lot of those little twiggy, uh, like, sapling-type trees, 
then uh, this is a good way to stock up waterlogged twigs, but they'll dry if you leave them in your inventory for a bit. And what was the thing I was gonna build? Backpack, so let's go build the prototype. We gotta be standing near the science machine. And then we'll search out for gold. Beginning of day four, we are getting started as will Lonnie. Episode one was a success. A, I would say a flying success. I might even be so bold as to say that. We'll leave the full thatch pack there. We'll back up storage if we ever need. Actually, no, we don't have to worry about monkeys. We can leave our sh stuff lying on the ground until storm season. Oh, don't retrieve. I guess we retrieve. Which, oh, click on the damn game, UTC. I hope that got recorded. Uh, click on the map. Where are we headed? Where do we want to head in search I say we head north. North's a good direction to head. We'll have a little triangle of islands that will be easy to travel between. Oh, and you know what? My food sources are low, so let's cook these berries. And hopefully, hopefully we get some fertilizer while we're gone and we can get these berry bushes up and kicking. And where's our boat? Get ready to place this mother. Drop it straight in the water, launch it, and ride it. Sweet! Okay. Northward bound, in search of new lands. Oh, I love it. Oh, yes. Can, are you not getting in back in the mood? This game made me fall in love with it when I first discovered this new DLC. And uh, I am, you know, I, I think I fell briefly out of love, but I might, I might be back in. I just got frustrated. I was like only making it to the nine, 10 day mark. And then this last time I was, I was going strong there, not going strong, but I was surviving which is all I ever do, it barely get by. But I was doing that and then we had a glitch ruin it all for us. What a mess that was. Uh, see ya, see ya, see ya, see ya. Wouldn't want to be ya. Yes, new lands. Uh-oh, I'm getting stuffed up, guys. It happens if I try and record too much in a row. I don't know why. Maybe my voice doesn't like, I don't know. It makes no sense, I have no idea why. But I'm getting stuffed up, which is a bad sign. Maybe I'm getting sick, who knows, I hope not. Oh, this is just shoals. This isn't land. Where's land? Give me land. We're headed north. We're having to dodge every damn wave that's coming our way. This is going to be no fun. And look how far we've gone without finding anything. Land, it looks like land to our right, maybe. Zoom out. Zoom out. Yes, I think somewhere over here. Yeah. Oh, yes. Okay, we've done it. I almost gave up just one moment too soon. Dang, we're here. Tell me there's more gold on this island. Or monkeys. I'll take some distant monkeys. Although they, I don't know how to get friendly poop out of monkeys. Like I only know how to like rile them up and get them to toss their poop at you, which is pretty unfortunate. There they are. There's the little monkey freaks. Good thing I brought my shovel. You're not gonna take my board, are you? All right. Let's pick up the board just to be safe and equip the shovel, and we'll start digging berry bushes. Give me a low, yes. Oh yes, okay. These monkeys are gonna be all over us. We're gonna have to compete with them to pick this stuff up. At least it's just one right now. They're gonna swarm us picking these berries. Too slow, idiot monkey, you moron. You idiot. Oh, he stole those berries, didn't he? You little freak. I. This is where I get the urge, hey! Dude stole my whole bush. This is where I get the urge to just whack him in the skull with a shovel and call it a day. Uh, this monkey is gonna be harassing me, haranguing me, and not leaving me alone for my entire- Hey, yeah, yeah, get out of here. Oh, shoot. All right, well, we got a good number of bushes and there's usually, yes, I thought so. Another supply there. Yeah, go get lost, idiots. Anytime you find one of those clusters, you find a few of those clusters. So we're gonna need fertilizer for all this. I could try and get monkey poop. I don't really know how to do it in a friendly way, so I'm just gonna grab flowers that we can hopefully turn into rot. I don't think we need a sanity headband yet. We're doing good. Sanity intact. Get, get screwed, you monkey idiots. This is, a, this is a lush land, and your instinct might be, hey, let's stick around here. Look at all these berry bushes. Maybe this is a home for us. Get lost, monkeys. Go away. But you don't want to be on... Oh, my God. We are... We are... Quote, unquote, balls deep in berries. 
What a glorious day this is. I might leave some of these here. Because we might need food. And I don't have enough. I can't re- No, we'll take them all. We'll take them all. Oh, this is good. Okay, guys. This is good timing. This is the midst of an episode where I now tell you we will be taking a very short break. Oh, with evening setting upon us, I'll build a quick fire. Yes, I'll take a break because i got to throw an ad in the middle of this thing anyway. Uh, Geeks, thanks for watching. I will be back with you in just a second. Here we go. Morning, day five. We're now in the middle of episode two of Walani's Run. I think that makes this episode 10 in the series overall. I've gathered nearly three stacks of berry bushes, Lord. They're 10 in a stack, and I want to make sure we have plenty of fertilizer. And I don't want to risk losing my sanity by starting a war with these monkeys, so I'm picking all their flowers. And then we're going to drop the flowers for rot, and we're just going to have to feed ourselves for a while until this berry farm gets up and running. And then if we combine berries with hopefully some other renewable resources, we get the crock pot going. Who knows? We could be good. We could have a, a solid source of food. Bring the board. The floater, as Walani calls it. Yes, we did. Get on it. Yeah, it's getting pretty beat up. That's all good. We're, we're hustling. And we are back on the open ocean, headed south from this hellhole monkey island. It looks like there's swamps up there, too. I ain't messing around with that. We're just going to take maybe the scenic route back, try and end up on the um, east side of our island. And maybe I'll grab some seaweed along the way. And uh, see maybe if we can't discover one more continent, because the goal was, of course, gold. I just don't want to push my boat too hard. I don't want to risk it. Yeah, our island's dead south. So hopefully you never know. Maybe we find something just by taking a slightly different route back. That's what I'm hoping. Yeah, she's a pretty cool character. I like her. I don't know what her downsides are. She certainly doesn't seem to have a crazy curse like old Woody. I love Woody. I mean, really interesting character. He's, he's got a great bonus in that axe. She's unbreakable and incredibly fast, but turns into a werebeaver in a full moon, I guess, is his deal. And then, especially if you throw monkey poop at him as he's transforming, he gets stuck like that for all eternity. Bummer. Uh, but it's definitely a problem I came across on the internet when I was looking around for other people who had had similar issues. It had happened to them, and I went and rewatched my video, and that is what happened to me. That's all good. We needed a fresh start anyway. My, my interest was waning, and now it is renewed, revitalized. At least for this run, I got a little more, I got a little more life in, left in me. I got a few more attempts, at least one more good attempt at this, to try and make it a good distance, to try and, you know, show off some skills. Yeah, right. Uh, is there another island here? Is there another island here? Or are we just heading back to plant berries? I gotta find that gold. I wanna find a little more gold. It's just a little more. I'm gonna get lost at sea trying to do this too. Come on, tell me there's an island over here. All right, fine, we're heading back. Screw you, waves. Screw you, ocean. And uh, we're headed back. We're going to plant a berry farm, and we don't need gold. We don't need you or your stupid gold, uh, ocean, and your deadly islands. We're going to make home on just a quiet little island. That's the game plan. No monkeys, no pigs, no spiders, just peace. Peace and quiet. I actually thought it might be fun to try and play a little more nomadic with her because you can pick up your boat and take it with you. Am I? Do I need to go north? I do need to go north. I have a feeling there's an island south of us, but we'll explore that next time. Get Oh, man, the waves are frequent this time of year, eh? All right, we'll grab a little more seaweed on our way back into port. Way back into, the, into town here. And we'll get started with this uh, berry farm. I'm stoked that every once in a while, and I, I think one of my better runs uh, off camera, one of my away from camera runs, happened when uh, I had found a berry collaboration, conglomeration like that. Uh, so I'm excited that we found one. We do have bees here. I forget about that. That's a bonus. Obviously more flint. Dropping flowers like crazy, and look, yeah, we're four berry bushes in. Let's clear a little space here, and we'll expand this berry farm. And I'll probably end this episode with this berry farm being complete. We're flying towards the end here. We're moving at a, a decent speed. 
And I'm having fun. It's nice that I'm getting to do slightly longer videos. I hope someday I can work them up even longer. You tell me what you think of video length. I used to try and keep them under 15. Now I try and keep them under 25 and I aim for 20. But it, it's different series that I'm doing too. So 25 petals, drop those, those will start rotten. And we can get we can get started expanding this farm. Shovel's broken, right? Oh no, I got a new shovel. So we don't need it and we're, it's not gonna grow back until we can fertilize it. But if I dig up these grass tufts, at least we'll have a, a nice clean area for this farm. And I wonder if I should build the pitchfork. Maybe put a little different soil underneath this farm. I know some people do that and it ends up like, it looks like it's like a little patch of ground. Let's see, let's see about building a pitchfork. I've, I've done it, but not recently. Where's pitchfork at? What do I need? Sticks, right, we are deadly, deathly low on sticks. That's gonna be the resource of issue on this damn island. I'll tell you that much. Where'd I leave my boat? Where did I leave my boat? Come on, boat! Oh, I left it way up there, idiot. Oh, good, no, darkness is upon us. Lovely. Uh, screw it, then we head back, we get this fire going. Do I need, I seriously need some wood. I'm out of wood. I don't even have the resources to get us going for tonight. Let's get a little grass to start the fire, I guess. And I'll try and chop down some jungle wood real quick. I have enough to make a new ax? I don't. Oh, this is gonna be a bad night. This is, okay, we got a challenge ahead of us then. This episode is not gonna be short. It's gonna be slightly longer than average. Uh, we're gonna be burning ourselves on grass unless 5% can chop down a tree. Nope, didn't think so. Okay, nighttime coming. It's coming suddenly. I don't wanna use all this grass for fuel, but we are, we're low on logs. Did I drop a bunch of logs here? Yes, I did, there we go. Tell me there's 20 here. Four, that's okay. Four will get us through the night. I don't have to panic. And we'll burn a little grass to go along with it. And we'll start planting bushes. This is gonna be fun. Uh, I haven't built a big farm yet in uh, Don't Starve. I think I have, but away from camera. So you guys haven't seen me actually successfully get going with a good farm, which is what I'm hoping to do today. I don't know about laying it out. Is there a good way to lay it out? I just kind of go randomly. Try and keep them bunched together so that they're easy to harvest and easy to fertilize and whatnot, but I don't know if there's a good system. Uh, yeah, just bunch it up. I probably should have picked up those seeds first. And I have so many more. I It's going to be too dark for me to keep planting here. Okay, well, let's add more fuel to the fire, I guess. That... This is suddenly a much louder fire. I think I may have made too big a fire. Do not burn down my berry, my berry farm, please. Yes, there we go, that's a little better. Oh, this is good, look how many we got. We got a, a literal F ton. We are, we are st like stocked up, seriously. If we can get these fertilized, and that is of course the challenge, but we got lots of those flower petals lying around and they will turn into rot, which we can use to fertilize. Soon, someday. Uh, and until then, we'll eat berries, we'll eat seaweed, life will be good. Let's cook a little berry. All right, geeks, we've made it through the night. I'm gonna call this one here. Thank you so much for checking out this episode of Don't Starve Shipwrecked. Episode two of our Wolani run, and I believe episode 10 in the series. Uh, I will be back with another episode for you in just a couple of days. Bye. Fallout 4, episode 21. Me and Kate here at the railroad's hideout. <laughs>